Hello gamers, it is Larson here, and today I'm going to be doing something really nice with the console known as Wii U. We're going to be installing Preloader on it. And you might be like, Larson, what does this have to do with Reconnect 24? Well, a lot. Because this actually makes it much more easy to use Reconnect 24 on your Wii U. I have my Toad Wii Remote here. The best Wii Remote to ever exist, because who doesn't love Toad? All right. We're gonna go to the Homebrew channel. Dark Umbra is a site that doesn't exist anymore, if you're wondering. This is just an old homebrewed Wii U. I never use homebrew on VWi, aka Wii U. Please wait while we in it. As I forgot to run, copy over the preloader. There we go. Never mind. Okay, so this is the new preloader RC three, release candidate three. I. We haven't updated our patcher or our guide yet. KCRPL, our admin, is currently not even in the country right now, Poland. He's in, like, Netherlands or something. Anyway, um, he's um, currently not able to update the patcher right now, and I'm kind of waiting to update Wii.guide until this becomes a stable version of Preloader. But, hey, we can actually do a couple cool things here. So I'm going to enable the set update. Um, a couple other things. I like this one. I don't like having the Wii Menu background music all the time, so I'm gonna do that. Um, so these are some additional hacks. And most important one, always enable Wii Connect 24 for VWi. So you wanna make sure you have this button. If you wanna have ReConnect 24 on your VWi with all functionality, you you gotta wanna create message via calendar button. Just turn that on. Always enable we connect twenty four V V. And another hack called fixed NWC twenty four I set universal time. Um, you have to go to Gary's site. Gary is the one who made this work. Gary Oder Nix. I don't know how you pronounce it. N I C H T S. Um, he made a code that will fix a timestamp issue, which has been happening on the Wii U for years because the news channel. Um, doesn't show the correct time and we had to make a workaround for the forecast channel in order to make it work correctly. So that's all well and good. So I forgot to mention what's awesome about this is now you can use Wii Mail on your Wii U. The mail patcher we have currently right now will work on it. Um, but there is no button to create a message. So you gotta, you have to do it like this. You have to go in here and create a message. Yeah, that error happens for some reason every now and then. There's a problem with Wii Connect 24. I don't know if it's gonna go away. Go away, error. There we go. I was gonna write Marco Polo. I don't even have my Wii on here, so it, my me, sorry. Okay. So you can check this out now, and this means we don't need this anymore. We do not need Connect Me anymore because ReConnect24 will automatically be enabled through your VWi with this. And this will probably fix a couple errors too, so. That's old. That's old information. January 6th. 
Let's check out news channel first. I know the symptom of the problem was that it wouldn't show the correct time that you updated the news. Um, so, um, like the last updated date was completely incorrect because there's some weird problem with the Wii U and the function that it uses to get the correct timestamp for Wii Connect 24. But Gary figured it out. He's a good guy. He, I don't know if he works on anything other than the Wii U stuff though. And it takes a minute to download the news. So yeah, you can test this out now if you if you want to install the release candidate. It's not the final version of Preloader 0.10. And I think a couple things need to be done before it's done, but and then when it's when it's released, I'll we'll update the patch or if KSRP can get around to it. And um he um and then we can sorry. We can um update we guide. We dot guide. Um and hey, look at that. The updated time shows up correctly now. This means that you can install the correct version of the Forecast Channel 2 because the version of the Forecast Channel we currently have... <coughs> excuse me. Um, I like having my news this much zoomed in. Um, the Forecast Channel that we have just keeps a static version of your forecast on the Wii because it it's a file that doesn't expire. We well, could technically fix 400006, but... This will be so much easier to do stuff on because this, you won't have, it will automatically clear out the files. We have, it just, all the forecast channel does is patch out the server URL to be the correct one to load an alternate file for the Wii U. All right. Um, just scratch my finger. Um, while we're here, let's check out the Everybody Votes channel. It will work fine, but I did not have to open up Connect Me. Isn't that awesome? I have my Wii over here, too. Um, if we have time, I'll show you, um, the mail being received on it. Yep. I already voted on these with my other Wii, so... That's all nice. The mail patcher will do will give you a warning when you try to install um if you try to patch your mail on it, but you can just ignore that. So basically all you need is preloader, um the the all you need is the files that Reconnect24 Patcher gives you for the Wii U. Um you can you can go back and get the regular forecast channel for Wii if you want. The problem with the forecast channel, like the original one, if you don't enable these hacks, they're gonna give you four zero 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 six. But um the correct one, um the you can grab that the Wii version of the forecast channel and then all the other files that the patch outputs for everything other than the forecast channel. You can install all those. This will be updated in our Wii guide and the patcher yet again. But you won't have to install Connect Me, so you'll need all those wads. You'll need preloader, and you'll need to enable those three hacks. You have to generate the hack and add it to the hacks hash any file on your preloader installation directory in your homebrew directory, your apps folder preloader. Um, you have to enable the set universal time hack, which is on Gary's website, and then you'll have to enable the calendar button, and then you'll also have to enable um, We Connect Twenty Four at all times. So that's what you're going to have to do. Um, it's pretty straightforward. Um, but hey, I can actually use We Connect 24 on VWE more effectively now. Um, I'm waiting for that Wii message. In the meantime, let's go to Nintendo Channel. Oh, what, have I never set it up on this Wii U? I have two Wii U consoles, actually. I just... And, like, five Wiis. Oh, by the way, I shouldn't be telling you this, but I'm going to tell you anyway, because it's not much of a secret anymore. We have some big news for, like, Wii users. Um, there's currently a thing. We, we pretty much got it to successfully work. Um, you can now, um... 
I'll view the sample. Um, you can now, um, well, when this is released, um, oh, there's my Wii. It's glowing a message. Um, you can now, ah, I can't, I can't say what I was going to say. Um, you can now, um, oh my God, how many times am I going to say you can now? Anyway, you will now be able to, not you can now, you'll now be able to, um, install Boot Me As Boot 2 on any Wii. Which is the base, best pro big protection you can get on a Wii. Unfortunately, the files that you need for it were in the Nintendo's Giga Leak, so... Unfortunately, it's not going to be too easy to um, get the files without pointing to a shady site or whatever. Um, but I'm going to open up the Checking Out channel just to check. For aforementioned reasons, I'm not going to open up the Forecast channel. Um... So you'll be able to install it on any way, even if you can only install it with a Hack Me installer as Boot Me on iOS, you'll be able to install it on any way. I did brick a Wii by trying to go through this process and it bricked it so bad that it wouldn't even, um, the disk drive wouldn't even start up when I opened the Wii. But one of the guys who was doing the testing on it, um, I gave him my Wii to fix. Okay. Hey, that's a great me. Okay. And we're gonna end this video by, um... By checking out that message I sent on the other way. I don't know what that is. Pete, Peter Griffin. Okay. FYI, I now have a massive bean bag that someone gave me in my living room. I'm getting a new roommate. And hopefully you'll be able to play Wii with me or Wii U or Switch. My current roommate does not like to play games with me. Okay, um, at my Luigi remote, I misplaced my Mario remote. It's somewhere on here. Okay, um, Marco, see, it works. I'll give you the links to everything in the description. Thank you. Bye.